Welcome to Blackboard Basics for Instructors, Part 1, Getting Started. To log in, you need two items, your MyBama username and your MyBama password. There are two ways to access Blackboard. Number one, MyBama. Enter your MyBama username and password into the login portal. After you log into MyBama, select Blackboard Learn on the Quick Links menu. The second way to access Blackboard is the direct URL, ualearn.blackboard.com. Use your MyBama username and password to log in. The Institution page is the Blackboard entry page. Activity Stream shows course activity and announcements. Courses shows the Blackboard course list. The Calendar shows personal, course, and institution events. Messages is the Course Messages dashboard. Grades is where you can see course grades for instructors and students. BB Assist shows campus resources links. Now let's go over Blackboard Learn's original course view. Number one, in original course view, the course menu appears on the left side of your window. You create links in the course menu to present tools and materials to students. Number two, the area after the course menu is the course management menu. It is your access point for your course management functions such as course style, tools, and users. Number three, course content appears in the main window to the right of the course menu. In the top right corner, you see A, edit mode. When edit mode is on, all instructor functions appear such as build content or the appearance of menus. B, functions. In the row above course content, access page level functions such as build content, assessments, tools, and partner content. These functions change based on where you are in the course. C, Options menu. These appear as arrow buttons throughout the course. A common need for courses is a syllabus. Add a syllabus and or connect your OIRA syllabus to your Blackboard course. A course textbook. Make sure your students know if their textbook is a physical textbook or an e-textbook. Course materials, files, and multimedia. Blackboard allows instructors to add all materials students need to develop the knowledge of a topic or lesson. Assignments and tests. From simple warm-up assignments and practice tests to essays and exams, Blackboard allows instructors to assess student knowledge. Participation and interaction. Students need tools to interact with each other in an online environment, such as discussions and blogs. In our Blackboard environment, we have a tool called Student View. In the upper right corner above your course view, click the Student View button. This allows you to see the course as your students see the course. To return to your own view, click the Return to Teacher View button. You can hide content that you aren't ready for students to see or make the entire course unavailable. On the course menu, the box icon next to the course homepage means this area is currently empty. The box with a slash through it next to announcements means this tool is hidden from student users. Use the options menu to click show link to make this available to student users. You can also check your course availability using the lock icon in the top right corner of the course. If you close the lock, this makes the course unavailable. Finally, let's go over the Blackboard Instructor app. This app allows instructors to view course content, modify settings, grade assignments, connect with students in discussions, and launch Blackboard Collaborate sessions. This app is available for iOS and Android mobile devices. Thank you for viewing part one of Blackboard Basics for Instructors. Don't forget to check out part two, Course Setup.